grocery store in Nevis, Minnesota. While we still don't know the full extent of the damage, the impact the community is already being felt. Valley News Team's Gabriel Osler explains. Brent Nicholson is the fire chief for Nevis, Minnesota, population 344. He's also a resident. He says the devastating fire that broke out at Northwoods Grocery and Cafe has been a blow to the small community. Spoke with my wife earlier and it was like, uh, yeah, it's, we, we count on that place, you know, as a, you know, for, for necessities. And so it, it's sad to see it gone. The fire began at around five in the morning in the basement of Northwoods and wasn't fully extinguished until three or four in the afternoon. Nicholson says that's because of its difficult placement within the building. The challenges here were obviously, you know, limited access to the seat of the fire and, and we just could not get water directly on the fire to put it out. We battled it for uh, a lot of hours and it was a result of not being able to get to the fire seat. The owner of Northwoods declined to speak on camera but did provide some additional details, saying he won't know the scope of the damage until the insurance company takes a look around, but that he does hope to reopen eventually. In the meantime, the investigation into the cause of the blaze is ongoing, and Nicholson is grateful for the assistance of fellow departments in getting everything under control. Really appreciate all the, all their help that they that they provide. Park Rapids and Ankeley both are are uh, great departments, and they uh, we really we all all of us rely on each other. In Nevis, Gabriel Osler, Valley News Live. The Hubbard County Sheriff's Office say they expect to release a statement on the fire at some point tomorrow. Man